Please sit. Sit. Lina tunjo tena tafadhali. Nafikiri wacha niko peke yangu nitampigia makofi ya kilo tu eh. Amefanya vizuri. Kwanza tueleze hii ala inaitwaje hii? Hii ambayo chombo wanatumia kwa muziki. Hiki chombo kinaitwa gojang. Ni kichombo cha ya utamaduni wa Kichina. Uh, ni chombo kinachotumika wakati wa sherehe. Sherehe zo aina yoyote ama sherehe za Sherehe za zote. Sherehe aina yoyote. Wakati wanapojumuika na familia zao no. ama wapendwa wao. No. Mtu anapoangalia anaiona iko na kama nyuzi nyuzi vile kama gitaa eh, lakini inatoa sauti ni kama piano. Je ni eh, ala yao ya kitamaduni ama ni ala ambayo imeanza kutokea hivi sasa tu kutoka eh, nchini China? Ni ala yao ya kitamaduni na kufundisha mtu kama huyu kwanza miaka mingapi na inachukua mbele ya kufundisha ala kama hii. Hakika ukimwangalia ni mtu mdogo eh, lakini si jana miaka mingapi pengine utueleze na pengine kwa yule aliyemfundisha imemchukua mbele gani kufundisha kupiga mziki na kuelewa na kufahamu. Imemchukua kitu kama miezi mitatu jina za sema ni mwepesi sana kwa kuelewa hizo. Kuelewa. Eh. Eh, na kuna mwalimu ambaye huwa anamfundisha. Kuna mwalimu ambaye umfundisha kila weekend. Kila weekend. Je, wapo je, wapo watoto wengine kama yeye ambao pia wamejiingiza katika eh, kutaka kutamani kujifundisha nyimbo za Kichina ama kwa sasa hivi hapa jina hilo pengine ni yeye tu. Na je, anatumika katika kwenda katika tamasha, sherehe za Kichina, eh, festivals nyingi tu eh, kuweza kupiga eh, mziki kwa kutumia ala hii. Uh, kwanza kwa shule yake um, kwa competition alishinda so ataenda kwa round nyingine um, kuna shule wanaofundisha hizi vile vidisi ya kucheza hizi vyombo na vyombo vingi huko ni hivi vya kutoka china mara nyingi ndio um, pengine kwa kwa, kwa malezo yako tu uh, yenzi kwa masuala uh, ya miradi tofauti lakini hivi sasa tunazungumzia tamasha je na kutangaza kwamba pia wa Kenya vile vile wamekumbatia utamaduni huu eh, kutoka China wameenzi pengine hata kushinda eh, tamaduni zingine je ni kutokana na urahisi wake ama kutokana na kwamba inapendeza tu kwa sababu ukisikiza ala zinapendeza ukisikiza watu wanazungumza mabimba pia inapendeza uh, utamaduni wa Kichina unapendeza yeah. kwanza kabisa um, wa China kila utamaduni unakuanga na kwa kila festival inakuanga na nyimbo zake na inakuanga na mavazi yake na inakuanga na dance zake kwa hivyo tuseme kwa sababu ya hizo vitu zote kuleta pamoja inavutia mpaka hata sisi wa Kenya sasa tunataka kukopi Asante sana. E, kuna wengi sana nafikiri wangetamani hasa mwelekezi wangu kumsikiza mtoto huyu akizungumza Kichina e, na vile vile mmoja tafsiri. Sasa sijui kama tutapata baadaye mmoja e, mwalimu wake mchina ambaye anaweza kumuliza maswali alafu kumpa maswali na yeye aweze kujibu pengine kuhusiana na msala. You can come. Come join us. Thank you very much. Mm, sasa una wewe njoo pande huu alafu mimi nikitoa niki, maswali pengine utakuwa na mba na yeye anaweza kumuuliza na pengine um, nataka kujua kama vile vokuliza hapo awali kufundisha mtoto kama huyu e, mdogo kuiba e, ni nyimbo za aina gani kwanza mnaanza kumfundisha nyimbo za wepesi nyimbo rahisi ama mnaanza tuna nyimbo ambazo ni ngumu kuzishika na kuzishika mara moja kwanza kabisa wacha ni introduce huyo anaitwa Tujingo Teach na ndio mama yake msana anaitwa Wendy ha, mama yake msana kabisa ndio na basi mimi nitakushikia alafu itakuwa rahisi kuzungumza um, uh, we could we could speak english right and then, all chinese <laughs> that's very funny that's very funny um i was talking about um, her age and uh, her perfection in in playing this instrument first and foremost um how long does it take um and you can you know you can speak in chinese or even in english and i'd like you to to address her as well um how long does it take her to learn um this instrument and to play the music so efficiently the way she has oh um Uh, in fact, uh, she learned uh, this instrument uh, one year ago. I'm so happy she met a good teacher, okay. Chinese teacher. Her name is Dai Jinghua. Uh -huh. She is also in Kenya. Okay. And uh, usually my girl like music. 
So when she teach her, uh, almost three or four times, she can master this song. Okay. Yes. So um, how long does it take? Um, say, for example, if she's done one song, can she learn one within a week, two, perhaps, maybe? Yeah. And I does she uh, do performances elsewhere, apart from, you know, today when we've seen on TV? Yeah, uh, usually she take a one or two weeks can learn one song. Uh -huh. She did the performance uh, at the University of Nairobi, uh -huh. even another Chinese school called Hua Yun Xue Tang. Uh-huh. And, uh, um, um, is this something she really loved or is it something that you really instilled on her? Do you, you know, uh, she really loved the music. Uh -huh. Of course, I also want to introduce her this uh, traditional Chinese uh, instrument to her because when she was young, she can manage it easily. Okay. I've seen um, on her fingers you've tied uh, a couple of things and I don't know what they are and how they assist uh, with playing um, this instrument. Yeah. What are they? Maybe you can describe to us. And, yeah, this you know. is a nail. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's like a nail mm -hmm. for the is finger. It yeah, I think it's plastic. It's a hard plastic, yeah. all right? All right. And how useful is it for, for you know, for, while playing the instrument? The music and can, can she show us clearly. while she's doing that? Yeah. yeah. Maybe you'll show. Uh, let them play again. Play a bit. Play a bit. Yeah. So, so essentially, she's not using her fingers. Just carry on. Yeah. She, just tell her to carry on. Essentially, she's not using her fingers to play yeah, the strings. Like she's a, using the nails. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's like a tool. It's like a tool. Right? Okay. And that's the only way you can play it. Can you play with bare fingers without using uh, that? Also can do, you but can the sound do will come out maybe not that Or the nice. sound will not yeah. be classy. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. So there are some people, including my director, who wanted yeah. to find out whether she can speak fluent Chinese, and we want yeah, you to to, to, uh, to to talk to her and you okay. know just you know talk as if you 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 at a ceremony and she's about mm. to perform and, you know, and then share the microphone with her as well. Uh, Speak loudly. Thank you so much. Mtu na mamake wanazungumza uh, kichina bila shaka ni lugha ambayo uh, tumeanza kuikumbatia kama ulivyoona wenzetu hapa wakiimba na kadhalika. Lakini hivi sasa siju mwelekezi wangu tanipa ruhusa maana naona vitafunio pale tuelekee kwenye hivyo vitafunio alafu tuweze kuulizwa. Uh, nafikiri tuje pamoja. Uh, tuweze kuonyeshwa ni vyakula vya aina gani vya kitamaduni ambavyo wageni huandaliwa wanapofika kwenye karamu eh, ambapo upenye mwenyeji huwa ni mchina na tumeweza kuona tu kuna vituo vingi tu hapa nchini ambayo ni hoteli eh, vituo vya kibiashara watu wanauza eh, vyakula tofauti pengine nitampa yeye eh, kipaza sauti akizungumza alafu na wewe unatueleza anasema nini kuhusiana na utamaduni eh, just carry on and tell us okay. uh, what what we are seeing on the display here today and what it's about okay 大家好,我叫许江,来自云绿罗比大学孔子学院。今天我们要给大家介绍一个中国的传统美食饺子。<笑> 中国人特别喜欢吃饺子 uh, kwa hivi leo tume kwa sababu ya muda ni mfupi kuna jauzi yenye imetengenezwa tayari ya, uh -huh. hii bado jachemshwa uh -huh. lakini imetengenezwa tu tayari. lakini hiki kimechemshwa uh -huh. kiko tayari kuliwa uh -huh. sasa pengine atatuonyesha pengine vile mnavyotayarisha ndio uh -huh. 呃我們的餃子呢是非常好吃的通常我們餃子用那個麵粉呃這個麵粉呢是用水和麵一起和在一起的 uh, Oh, jauzi inatengenezwa na unga wa ngano uh -huh. na maji unga kawaida tu. Uh -huh. Je, ni una, inakuwa fermented ama unatumia vile vile 
kama sisi ambao cha nyingine tunatumia unga ngano kutengeneza chapati na vitu vingine. Ni ile tu ile tunatengeneza chapati. Aha. Okay. 呃这个饺子呢呃这个面团呢是有水和面一起和成的然后呢我们要把它分成一小块一小块然后我要用这个擀面杖把这个呃小剂子擀成片儿呃procedure Alafu unaweza tumia nyama ya ngombe, nguruwe, kuku, mboga kama chapati ama cabbage. Eh, lakini ni kama ni nyama zinakuwa nyama za kusagwa. Eh, minced meat. Kama minced meat vile. Yeah. Okay, kama sasa hii imechanganya nini na nini? Pengine tuweze kuonyesha watazamaji. Eh,當我把餃子片擀好以後,我把餃子片放手裡,然後呢,我放一點這個這個餃放在這個片上,然後呢,把它包起來。Okay, kwa leo tuko na nyama ya ngombe imechanganywa na carrots mm -hmm. na vitungu. Mm -hmm. Na ni nyama pengine iko mbichi ama ishachemshwa, imekaangwa ama imehifadhiwa kwa njia gani ndio tuweze kujua kama ikishachemshwa pamoja na unga ngano inaweza kulika ama namna gani? Hii haijachemshwa. Lakini hii imechemshwa iko tayari kukuliwa. Okay. So hii bado ni nyama mbichi. Hii bado ni nyama mbichi. Nyama mbichi ala, okay. Uh今天我们的饺子馅是牛肉和胡萝卜馅的而且今天我们已经带来包好的饺子。这是我们已经包好的饺子。Dakika 10 unaweka maji moto. Peke yake. Ndio. Maji ya moto dakika 10 peke yake. Unachemsha maji moto, unatumbukiza ndani, alafu zita float. Eh. Ziki float sasa utajua zimekuwa tayari. Zimekuwa tayari kuiva. Okay. Wowしゃんしゃんとフレンチ尝尝我们的饺子。可不可以？可以又taste。那那不，那不，你按着锅煮。啊。马来西亚，马来西亚，马来西亚，马来西亚，马来西亚，马来西亚，马来西亚，马
世界，春天的世界。生活。